Good evening, everybody, on this uh, frosty night, <laughs> at least where I'm at. Uh, welcome to the stream. I'm Milo Molson here, and today we're going to be playing a little more Blasphemous. Um, hopefully I can get past the kind of lack of direction that I had in the last dinner stream. Uh, I wasn't sure where everything was, so I, I did check a guide and just kind of glazed over a little bit of it. So I think there's something I'm going to try, and if not, I'll have to read it more. But I try to minimize that kind of thing. Um, anyhow, I'll take us in here. You want to sip? Good thing. Good to see you, Nui. Alright. Right there. Let's see. Where's it? There it is. Alright. Back on our pilgrimage. Alright, Echo's Assault. So I'm going to go back from here and go back on the Hondo. Which, here we are. Uh. I'm trying to get a little hot. Uh, there's a statue I'm looking for, from what I gather. So we're gonna find that as we may. I already got this. It was a, a power of some sort. All right, slice and dice, baby. Oh wait, <laughs> I need to be using the D-pad more than the stick. Kind of take a second to get used to the control. Uh, see, I'm, I'm not in my uh, blasphemous mode. I think the last time I played it was, was Thursday, which is not that long, so it shouldn't take long to come back. Of course, here we are at a pre-June, however that is pronounced. It's kind of strange that it... I think that's French, because uh, I think Dieu is French, and Deus would be Latin. And Adios would be Spanish, of course. Okay, okay. Woo! <laughs> I remember the spikes. Got to think about the spike bits. All right, and that was not an elevator, despite the chains that might make you think so. All right. Oh, hold on. Yeah, remembering these controls is going to take half. I've been playing a lot of Vintage Story off uh, off stream, to be honest. Um, grinding that steel. All right, let's see what else we got. Let's get off here. What a, uh, so I can't remember if the statue was up at the very top or in the middle so we're just going to keep going oh, well no this wasn't it this one we've already broken alright can we go up can we get much higher no we gotta go left alright what's up here mm, keep going See how that's it's kind of swinging in the background, <laughs> menacingly. Okay, so this might be it. Let's uh. So that was it. I had to break both of the chain halves, and then okay. See, I'd been hitting that for a little bit. Grievance ascends, but we're going down. That's weird. I guess for every up there must be a down. Indeed, it is the groan. It comes from the deepest core of this place. Simmering in spirals, growing with its own echo, distorting amidst the broths and bossings. Uh, oh shit. Well, I missed that line. The intertwined throat is born of a single penance, a single mourning. Light hardly ever reaches here, only the cold and the groan. <clears throat> Doing a little groaning. Alright, now we gotta take care of these jokers here. They're from, they remind me of the guys from the, oh wow, this is kind of a little grab bag of uh, enemies here, because... We got some from the the snowy steps. We got one from the fire area. So, or what's this? Uh, the um, no, it's up here. It was uh, the convent of Our Lady of the Charred Visage or Visage. I, I, one of these days I'll remember how to say that. I do like this uh, power up that shows the health on the enemies. It's kind of handy, so you know how much you got to swing. All right, we're we're basically in explore mode right now, since this is all new. All right, let's uh, we open our teleporter network up again, and I won't go th really go through it. I don't well, don't have any. I think I might have had some rosemary or something to give them. Maybe not. What is this? This is a grieving veil. Okay. Okay, so nothing interesting. 
we'll just continue on then. On our merry way. Now look at this fog. Okay. We gotta deal with this bell guy. These are not too bad. They're like four or five hits. There we go. Now, of course, when there's more of them, it might be a little different, but... Still. Okay. You take a hit here and there. It's just part of gaming. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes you take a few more hits. I probably like spawn. Oh, that was... Hey, that wasn't too bad, actually. But it does... It, I'm sure that will slow you down if they respawn and they do the gating again on that. Yeah. Also, I need to make sure I got my moss set up here. Uh, what do we got? The fourth, um, this is reduces dodging cool to odd, you know. It doesn't seem to make that much of a difference, so we're going to go with the moss here, because that, that might save us a little bit on this cloud. I'm not sure how much it actually does, but it seems to help. And, of course, we'll go ahead and take this guy before that shit comes back. And it's here. It's so here. Well, okay. Now, if we can chill up here, it's not that bad. These are crumbly, it looks like. Alright, and here's another, um, this is where you can uh, pay for your sins away. 2400 Get the hell out of here, dude. Then again, my bar is getting kind of small. Alright, now nah, I'm going to save my save my cash here. Maybe something cool will come up, you know? I don't even use the magic that much, to be honest. Alright, uh, alright, what's it down here? Must be. Uh-oh. Here we go. Might go ahead and pop one of these bad boys. All right, let's do the door number three here. Yep, more pain. Oh, God. This lady looks kind of severe. All right, nice, Perry. There you go, get wrecked. Okay, well, I got wrecked that time. I thought, ah, see, see how low that bar is? I thought for sure I'd have her. Oh, that's what you get for being cocky. I, I was holding off on my health potion when I should have took it. Because I thought I'd be able to get a long range attack off on her. But, uh, that's just the way it goes here. That's just the way it is. <laughs> Here we go. Man, am I crazy or am I attack doing a little bit more damage? I'm not sure. Because, uh... I know this seems a little tougher on the, the icy mountain anyway. Now, I have gone through here. And I should go... You know, let's check left just to just out of being the sake. Okay, we already checked this. That's right. Well, at least it's a convenient way to get around. And hopefully... Okay, so they don't... On the on the second path, they don't uh, lock you in there, which is nice. All right, go ahead and take that. Does a little bit of damage, doesn't it? Of course, with my uh, fervor bar being nerfed as it is, the repeated dying attempts. <laughs> well, not attempts, just that's just the way it is. Alright, back up the wall here. Alright, man, I'm, I'm forgetting my map here. Oh, 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 get, get the out, 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 out. out. Alright, because that's that. Ouchies. <laughs> oh, here's where we died. Alright, a little more parrying, a little less uh, getting hit. Oh, that was perfect. Perfect. Don't be cocky. So they disappear just about as soon as that happens. Oh, 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 oh so they're. Ah, that's interesting. Until I get one of them down, parrying is going to be hard because they're coming at me from both sides. 
but now I can just do that. Well, that was pretty slick. All right, uh, let's see. Let's kill this guy right here. Ah, shit. All right, parry. These are kind of fun. <laughs> I gotta admit. All right, now should I go? I usually do go up. There we go. Another one of these. Terrible jumping, by the way. Terrible jumping. One of these days I'll stop getting hit. There we go. Pretty easy. Take the ledge. Okay, so there's something above there. Otherwise that cloud wouldn't do what it does there. Alright, now I, I have a feeling that we're going to get locked in here again. Yes, we are. Alright, as well, we got rid of one enemy, so if I can uh, continue to do so, we'll be alright. There we go. Alright. Oh, shit. <laughs> Well, at least if we uh, manage to win, we'll be able to skip through this next time, because god damn. <laughs> greedy, greedy, greedy. Alright. There we go. Perfect. Not perfect. <laughs> Not ideal. All right, we cleared that, so that's unlocked. Oh, oh no! All right, am I gonna be able to get to that in time? <laughs> Take your bets. But I gotta know what it is. I gotta know. Uh, the the frontal Martinus. Okay, so that's a bone. The frontal of Martinus, the rope maker. Artisan Martinus Hafnia was unjustly accused of selling brittle strings and sentenced to be hanged with one of his own creations. That very sad day, he regained his honor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it, it worked pretty well, apparently. And they're like, well, I guess, uh, I guess his stuff wasn't that bad but imagine getting executed for like selling bad quality products that would uh and i well i mean some places do that i guess uh can we get through here all right so we're just gonna chill out here for a second that cloud moves quickly boy Alright, we'll just chill here for a sec. Because if I get in that gas for any appreciable amount of time, it's going to kill me. That gas is too loud. Oh, fuck. Okay. <laughs> appears if you just kind of uh, skate the edge of it, it's not going to get you too bad, but... Really, I am a little confused on this section. Let's see. This is about... Well, I was trying to move my camera, but you can't really move your camera when you're, uh, when you're hanging on this. Maybe I should have been waiting. Ah, yes. What's this? The Silvered Lung of Dolphos. Organ preserved in sparkling silver with plenty of filigrees. Cardinal Dolphos melted his spoons in a pot looking to escape jealousies within the Argentine concoction, which Argentine is silver, not the litter. Well, I guess, I guess that country is named after the Rio Plata or something like that. Um, protects the wearer from poisonous miasma. All right, I'm definitely having that. So now I don't have to worry about that, and that means I can get rid of my moss and put something else in there. I think I had the toe. 
But what is this? Protection against flames. I'll take the wax for now. But that's good. I've been wondering about this thing forever. And now we finally have it. How cool is that? Alright, what was, uh... And now we can go through this without having a care in the world. Except for any enemies that might be there. Um... Rather than try to deal with those guys, I think I'm just going to go ahead and reset everything. Wait, hold on, what's this? If I can get that real fast. If it's going to reset me anyway. Well, whatever. I, I almost got there. <laughs> but yeah, we're, we're still good on that regard, so. Man, that's a lot of uh, backtracking and exploring i got to do now. Real Metroidvania moment. Alright. Uh, take care of this guy. Damn it. I was hoping I could slip past these guys, but... Nope. You gotta deal with them. Well, you... It, it might be possible. Actually, it is possible. I just did a really sloppy job of it. Alright, this was a teleporter, so... Yeah, we'll be using that pretty shortly. i uh, just skip, skip through this area. Not really trying to start a fight here. Ugh. Alright. Oh, and there there I died. Much better done this time. What is this? This is acquired a knot of rosary rope, so if I see a rosary lady again, I I'll definitely uh hit her up because I like having the rosary powers. I think she was in the 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 Brotherhood area. Pretty sure it would make sense anyhow. Ooh boy! All right, back up we go. If, without this silvered lung, you would have been uh, or I would have been dead, big time. Man, as easy as hitting a sword on a statue. <laughs> Alright, what's over here? Pain, death, and destruction. Standard fare, really. Now, surely we've been here. It's like, but have we, though? No. Probably not, because the map is unexplored. Ah, stop hitting me. <laughs> Alright, take another one of vials. What you got? Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no, it's the consequences of my own actions. Alright, well. I can't be mad, because this I got this lung, man. Everything is great now. It's all hunky-dory. Well. Kinda. I am getting hit a lot more than I ought to be. It's kind of a weird day. Alright, we'll see. Oh, well our extra superpower comes in handy. Let's, uh... Okay. Yeah, because should have seen that one coming. Now, what is the purpose of this? What is this for? Weird. Oh, it should have been working. That would have been very cool. <laughs> also, for whatever reason, the up attacks are kind of slow to toggle. Uh, not that one, though. <laughs> Alright, come here. Where'd she go? I don't care. I don't really care to fight her. Alright. Alright, but I will... Alright, come here. There you go. See this? We just kind of make our leisurely way over here. Yeah, this is nice. What do we got? Uh, melted golden coins. What would I use those for? Let's see what... Uh, these gold pieces melt into a distorted mass that never loses its shine. 
Uh, an egg made of rough hair. Ooh. Alright, I don't have a good upward attack, so. Ah, oh, shit. I'm getting ran through here. Alright, she'll be back. There we go. Yeah, a lot of this area. Well, I guess it does. Alright. Might as well use it. So, we're on our last health here. But right now, we're just surveying the map, uh, in a sense. Alright, what was here? Have I been in here? Is this where I came from? Yes. Alright, back down. Let's deal with this guy. Maybe I can get it done real quick. No. See, I hate how they're going to go off the map like that, because then you can't follow up on your tech. But it's all part of the all part of the plan, I guess. All right, see what's in here. All right, so we're we're set now. Oh, another boss area. Penitente en el silencio. Nope. I'm glad that she always knows where to find these guys and help me out, but... Who is she, by the way? I wonder. I wonder if they'll ever explain that. Hopefully. There's that other power that I don't have and don't really know much about. Oh, we got some petals of flowers here. That's neat. have some melted gold coins. Oh, oh, this is where that shit goes. Oh, very cool. Man, she's rejecting everything. And here's the veil. Oh, oh my God. High grace, or high thanks. Ooh, high praise. Yo, she kind of bad though. Yeah, hey Jay, good to see you, man. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you got three, three, three faces and a, a, a rocking beard, it looks like. <laughs> Booba, yes, they, but since this is a mature game, it's not against the, the, the problems or whatever. <laughs> but TOS. We've gotten the egg of deformity. Okay, what does it do though? So we got uh, a hirsute egg born of abomination. Its hairy shell hides the unfathomable mysteries from uh, prying eyes. The cruelty of a broken promise shaped Altus Gracias, and the affliction made her sorrows into flesh. Can't believe they put a hot tub streamer in the game, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I even uh, dropped these gold coins on her, so I, I simped for her, for sure. I fell for it, guys. Alright, let's see. What do we got? So we got... I don't even know what this does, but I'm sure it'll come up in a story thing. Or maybe it won't. This, it's got big side quest energy, I think. So, But there was a boss over here, I think. Uh, Cause this lady never shows up unless there is a boss. Uh, that one. So we're gonna. I guess we're gonna go in there and take our ass whooping. <laughs> <clears throat> so here we go. What kind of horrors will it show to me this time? Oh 
Okay. Tres sanguistas. Oh, this music is killer, though. Oh, my Don Quixote shit. <laughs> okay. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> Why is the floor on fire? Why? <laughs> the floor is lava, everybody. They finally did it. Those lasers do be hitting, though. I wonder if there's a time limit, like if you if there's a ceiling that it gets to and then it's just over, oh my god. if we're gonna make it. I'm not really doing enough damage and these lasers are... It's a war of attrition right now and I'm losing it. Okay, don't jump in the fire by the way. That would be not very cash money. Oh my god damn. We can't take much more of this. Alright, if I win, it's gonna be sure pure luck. Not very cash got time. <laughs> Alright, it's so over, guys. It's so over. Oh wait, is it though? Ah, oh, first try! Fuck yeah! Man, they went shit. I had it. <laughs> Requiem Eternum. Yeah, very Poggers moment right there. Guilt has been expiated. Oh, and we get a free thing. So I thank God I didn't go to that place and pay twenty four hundred to get it back. All right, so here's our third wound here. Well, this dude's looking a little frail. And once again, we're on the sea of whatever it's called. Somewhere beyond the sea. Alright. The Holy Wound of Contrition. And that's the third wound... Handsome Squidward looking ass head. Yeah, it does look like it. It does look that a lot. And the final door has opened to us. Well, final question mark, but that's where we need to go anyway. All right, what's through this door? Oh, it's our narrator friend. Se os ha permitido conocer la faz de la contrición. Penitente en el silencio, tras haberos humillado ante los santos rostros custodiantes, la puerta al final del puente del Calvario se ha abierto. Cruzad ahora su umbral bajo la férrea mirada de su santidad. Los penitentes cargamos con una culpa tal que quizás la aflicción nos da un segundo aliento. Pero no os confiéis. Puede que entre plegarias nos llegue reptando sigilosamente algún día. Hmm. All right, let's pull the lever, Kron. Oh, and we get a little elevator. 
So this, ah, I was wondering when we'd see this. Also, I do want to check all this area out now that I have that ability to withstand the gas. Oh, and more boobs and more health. Tomad el siguiente de mis dolores profundos. Maximum health has increased. I like to see that. We are a big fan of maximum health increases yet yeah, here on the Mob Molson channel. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Ah, shit, I'm going to come back down. Maybe I won't, because that's a long ass way. There's a lot of shit in there I'm missing. Well, I guess we'll find out. Alright, so here we are in the cistern. We're getting down with the cistern. There's that ladder. How did I not pull that before? I feel like I've been here before. Well, I mean, I've been in this area before, but this room. Maybe. Anyway, this one will be not too bad because we can. Okay, well, you have to come out a little higher on that. Ah, we're close, we're close. There we go. Alright, so we're about not even halfway. <laughs> Whatever. I'm not I'm not really focusing on those. Uh so what uh where was it? Left, right, up, down, sideways? Wait, this door doesn't look right. Usually they glow blue when there's something in there. Oh, because this is outside. Yeah, I remember this area. Alright, so where are you going? Let's go left. Maybe I should take care of these guys, too. If I see one, I'm going to kill it. That's where we go. Uh, yeah, let's go left. Have at the... Oh, shit. I should I should really be finding a pre-jew. But there, there's only one in this area, and it's, like, way far away. So just don't get hit. Is that it? Don't get hit. That's all. <laughs> uh, down? Yeah, let's go down. Alright, so, yeah, we need to get over there somehow. But how are we going to do that? Ah, oh, shit, he had, a, he had hands. Okay, we're getting hit, by the way. Um, yeah, this area, we've already explored its wonders or whatever. So let's go back up here. Oh shit. <laughs> I guess that moss would help in, with those things right there. There we go. But I, I, I'll be alright. Famous last words, right? Let's go uh, this way. Hello, Mr. Rat Friend. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> There's so many of these slime guys. Alright. Should seriously consider. Oh, you know what? I'll pay a little money and uh, get my stuff refilled here. I, I can do that. Uh, 650. Yeah, why not? That'll save all the enemies from respawning. Alright, what's up? Ah, see, I never did figure out how to get up there. I think... Well, you might need a, a charm that makes you jump higher. I don't know. Is there, a, is there ever going to be a double jump in here? I feel like it'd be kind of sad if there weren't, but... We, do, we are pretty far in the story, so to speak. That boy can't jump. Nope. But can you blame him in all that armor? <laughs> you know, at some point, it makes sense. He is not a hooper, no. You can't call yourself a baller like that. Alright. Woo! 
Oh, this is where I just was. <laughs> Ooh, all right. Uh, we're going back down. Blasphemous will never be balling. Yep. John Blasphemous. <laughs> all right. So I know up there, but I think I already went through here because some of these areas you can kind of cheese it if you've got the moss. Uh, that one I think was a problem of altitude most of this other stuff I think you can just kind of ch cheese it but well this one also there must be some sort of jumping ability that I'm missing alright and left is well we can't quite look yeah we can yeah we can take a moment to heal here first Wait, I heard a bell. Oh, that guy. Uh, see, this this is what got us last time. Of course, I, if I remember, there was a, a jumping aspect to this that made it kind of impossible, too. Yeah, see? We can't get that high. We, we need to be able to jump. Hey, Tracy, it's good to see me. Just uh, got our third wound a little bit ago, and we're trying to wrap up a couple loose oh shit I think try to wrap up a couple loose ends at least some questions unanswered but then I'll go uh, confront the guy let's see cool 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 yeah what I really would like to know is what's in the middle of the map there all the way on the left it's like a lot of, a lot of weird questions if I would stop hitting these, every single one of them, oh my god. <laughs> Alright, we can kill her. Alright. <clears throat> I'm not sure what her deal is. Um, hmm. Yeah, there's, there's more to it than this. Maybe if I... If I went to the hand... and went to Alberto and then come back down maybe I could make something work I don't know I might just go ahead and try the boss because who knows how long it would take um sunglasses sir good to see you see you steer yeah all right let's see all right well, well what does our map say our map says there's some shit here that we don't know what's going on but uh, and like I said, I already explored up there. This was maybe that was a gas thing. I, and I need to get my rosary upgraded anyway, so might as well head over there. So let's head right. I think just a straight right out. We, we need to head to this. Uh, will this door do it for us? Yes. So then we go down without getting slimed on too much. Go ahead and avail ourselves of this. Get everything charged up, because we're not going to be back here for a little bit, I don't think. Alright, this is where we got our first wound, I think. Slide for extra speed. Oh yeah, this was the first boss here. Or not the first one, but the first one that was uh, kind of tough. Alright, what else? Okay, that's right. We're going to head right, and we're going to go to... The Brotherhood first. Also, that thing right there. There's like a lot of little, tiny little out of the way areas that kind of make me wonder. But anyway, Brotherhood of Silent Sorrow. Let's get our, uh, our rosary upgraded here, which would be upstairs. Yeah, this one. Will do. 
All right, what do we got? We got one extra slot here. So what are we gonna put in there? Mm, let's try this one out. I haven't used it before. Okay. And we still don't have that other power that would help us in the ice area. So I'm thinking that's an optional one, probably. I'm kind of tempted to just go ahead and see, uh, you know, confront that guy over there. Maybe because they probably don't. There's probably a, a some sort of indication that it would, you know, a lot of times the game will say, "Hey, if you go any further, it's over for you." Right? <laughs> this is the this is the last stop. So I think hopefully this game will do that. Hopefully. So uh, we will go back to Albero and uh, do that. Because I'm I'm scratching my head here about uh, okay well we don't have any guilt we need to return here so down we go again I'm really kind of curious also about what this uh, egg does <laughs> oh we're already here uh da -da -da -da. Oh, and I guess I'll, when, when I'm in, uh, I'm there. I'll go ahead and return some of these bones too. Uh huh. Do we have any? Shouldn't have any upgrades available. I've got some coin now, or not coin, but uh, tears. So holy wrath, eight thousand. I'm kind of saving for that one a little bit because that sounds like a very powerful attack. Uh, and we've pretty much given all the ingredients we can right now to this guy. But I'll double check. El tiempo y fuera transcurre, pero si vuestra pecón pungi. Yeah, yeah. All right, cool. And you're satisfied. All right, next remnants. I forgot what this room does. <laughs> Let's throw some more money at him. Why not? Let's break him off. One. Four hundred. That's a good ten percent tithe, right? <laughs> ah, let's make it cooler. There we go. <laughs> All right, there we go. Hopefully that does something eventually. But if not. Okay, so actually, it was... Uh, you have to go further down, apparently. Forgot about that. Right, go ahead and skip this little sequence right here. Slide through. Alright, what you got for me? Ah, we got some more tears. So... All right, that was a nice little uh, little bit right there. It looks like they're are the right, but you know, I feel like we've uncovered most of the map. But apparently, there's a lot more to go. So we'll just keep it in mind. Keep it in mind. Kind of little cool, cool lore, lore stories. Eh. All right, so I well, do I want to go up? Do I want to go down? Let's check this elevator out, actually. I'm kind of curious. Uh, okay, so we're back here. No, you know what? I won't. We're, we're just going to go with the original plan here and check out the, uh, the area that has been unlocked to us. Because maybe it'll have some sort of power. You never know. A lot of sliding and walking. The guy back there looked like he was uh, enjoying lunch or something. Alright, remember this area? Alright, what you got? There you go. Oh, slide. I don't need the health, so I guess I'll just leave him. I'm not sure even have that power up equipped, but anyway, we're going to go right straight through here. So. If possible, it might take a little bit of uh, jumping up and down. 
as platformers often do. Okay, so we took a little hit there. Uh, yep, still looking good. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Man, these stone throwers really get on my nerves a little bit. So, well, actually, they don't. <laughs> Compared to... They're, they're some of the easiest enemies. I take it back. They're not so bad. Worst still is probably the uh, the ghost with laser beams. Oh, that was an execution right there. Ooh. Alright, what do we got? Go through here. Oh, hey, I like this guy here. I was wondering why these trees had to be knocked over. It's for this fellow. We got the little toe of limestone. Hell yeah. My toe collection grows ever larger. Alright, so we've got two now. And this is the... Uh, increases the dodging distance. Oh, that would be kind of cool to have. Actually, it'd be really cool to have. So let's go ahead and unequip this tombstone thing. I haven't really explored it much, but if you combine that with the, uh, the extra dodging, or reduced cooldown, you could probably cover some territory. Let me make sure this guy's all set, though. Alright, so we're continuing on. You know, there's still substantial gaps in this road, though, so I'm kind of curious how he's going to be, but... Alright, go ahead and save. The Bridge of the Three Calvaries. Hermana, que estáis ahí, aunque no pueda veros. Escucha mi ruego. Tras vuestra marcha, me toca demostrar que soy digno de la confianza de nuestra capitana. No defraudaré a Crisanta. Y que un gran dolor me muerda si permito que la penitencia cruce esta puerta. ¡En guardia, penitente! All right, let's go, boy. <laughs> ah, esa luz fugaz. No puede ser ella. Oh, that's right. I, his sister uh, kind of wanted him to chill out a little bit. <laughs> Es verdad, hermana. ¿Es esta realmente la sublime luz de vuestra virtud? Entonces, habéis obtenido el favor tan preciado, tan bienaventurado de mi hermana. Yep. <laughs> Con su bendición nos ha concedido la facultad de poder oír su noble voz llena de gratitudes. Claro. Penitente, reuníos conmigo en la capilla donde la culpa obtuvo su nacimiento. All right. Allí donde fuisteis clamado. Looks like we don't have to fight this guy. That's cool. Nos arrodillasteis por primera vez. Será entonces, en ese apartado lugar, cuando mi hermana oirá mi ruego, y así me traerá su voz de nuevo. Taranto to my sister. What is that? It looks like a spell, perhaps. Ah, it is. Uh, plea to the storms, intoned by dry throats and shaking voices, calls forth blazing rays that pierce the clouds, striking down... Ooh. So that's like the second thunder thing. Um. Yeah, that sounds pretty cool. Let's try that out. <laughs> All right. Well, that was pretty chill, I guess. And here we are at the door.
So an iron tree. Interesting. A sacred light stains the highest branches of the iron tree. Its brilliance penetrates its walls into the hall where she rests, shrouding my eyes in purple darkness. I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos in the past few days on uh, ancient iron working and <laughs> uh, pulling iron out of sand and iron ore and uh, making iron blooms out of it and all the ancient steel making techniques. I don't know, I just kind of got interested in it recently. It's kind of cool. Uh, it's amazing what they could do back then without uh, even understanding the chemistry and all that. And uh, some places in Africa apparently discovered iron working before they discovered copper working, which is interesting because it's usually the other way around. Aquellos a los que habéis sacado del castigo eran perpetua y esdras, hermanos expósitos que acabaron perteneciendo a la guardia de su santidad. Se decía que Perpetua podía hablar con su hermano después de muerta. Es true. Pues nudosos son los caminos del milagro. Ain't it funny how shit works out? <laughs> Alright, what do we got here? I want to go up there and see what's going on. All right, that door is sealed off. This one is not. Oh, this is a... Is that... Mm, it might just be shiny. Hopefully it's not blood all over the floor. That'd be kind of nasty. And we got some Quicksilver. So if we wanted to knock off another vial and make the other ones even better, we could do that, but... I'm not sure I want to do that. And what is this for? What does this do? No say... Well, let's go. Alright, have we checked out? No, we haven't checked this one out either. Oh, sweet. So this is, we're back on the teleporter network. But I don't have any cool new powers to really do anything. So let's check further. Alright, what does this uh, corpse say? This is where we started. So, I've already been here for sure. Um, I guess we'll go back to where the uh, pre do. I'm butchering that every time. And um, I see what's beyond the door here. Narrator man is gone. Oh well. On this sacred floor, I will be safe. They will hear neither my footsteps nor my fear. The miracle wanted the oranges from those trees to make no sound on falling, so that only uh, wind going through the columns and buttresses could be heard. Now I hear only the horrific screams of those punished by the miracle. I will wait patiently. Hmm. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's why there's a save point there, I imagine. Those platforms crumble a little faster than the other ones, it looks like. At least my guilt's right here. Alright, cool. Alright, have... Okay, this one's gonna be easy. Oh, these brambles, they kind of... Makes me recall, um... Call that, let me take care of this dude right here. There you go. It's no good to be burning alive like that. Alright, we got a ladder here. No. So that's going to be some backtracking, it looks like. Um. Mm. Ooh. I remember these guys. Don't like them much. At least our defense is a little better. Not that. Oh my god. So, okay, so that is the one that hurts. The blue magic. No, I don't have that equipped, so. Might as well just. Well. <laughs> whatever. Alright, so if getting hit by them is not great, getting hit by the blue stuff is terrible. Sometimes. I don't know. It's inconsistent, it seems. Alright, took care of. Oh, shit. <laughs> Man, those are fast. And does it come back? Maybe. 
Oh, fuck. <laughs> Man, I got. Oh, shit. I gotta watch out for those. Also, heal more. Those instant floor dissolve. Hopefully, they stay dissolved, because. I don't think you could even jump off that very well. Alright, watch out for the brambles. Kind of reminds me of that that quote unquote first boss. Alright, here you go. So, let's try this again. <laughs> Oh, don't, no way I can make that jump. Nope. We're going to need some other power. Which will probably help us out in that pirate area, so... Or I could just backtrack to the left there. Oh, so the spikes get those guys... Okay, alright. I'm not so... You know, that's fair enough. Fair. Could probably use that to my advantage. Alright. Gotta keep a hawk eye out for this terrible situation. All right, so here, here we go. So we got a uh, fibula of Risp, the ranger. Risp Scrimshaw was known for his reckless nightly walks in the woods. He said they helped him think about what was beyond, beyond even the high wills. Man was out in space. All right, what's up here? All right, the ooh, okay. So you can't just straight up jump that. These guys, I think, are about a three hitters right here. Unless I can... There we go. Seems the ranged attack does a little bit more. Okay. Alright, and this guy will try to cause me some grief. And rather than mess with him like that... Actually, I can... Okay, so I definitely have gotten more powerful. Because used to, they, they, would, they would take three for sure. Okay. It's calmly, carefully, and collectively. <laughs> Alright, what do we got? Okay. Alright, now how am I going to be able to make that? I'm not, unless I have some sort of double jump, probably. You know, it's almost like you can uh, infer the existence of certain powers just by patterns you see uh, throughout the game world. There's there's some things that you'd like. I'd have to be able to do this or that to do, and that's, it's kind of well. Then there probably is a power to do so. <laughs> I mean that that's I guess kind of obvious, but okay. So he got a little splashback on that one. Looks like. Um, no way I'm gonna make that jump. So. Alright, and this one, this is going to be precarious. I don't know if I even want to do it. I think I'll just take what I got. Ah, I should have stayed up there, damn it. Can I go, well, can I make it back? Yep, that was a collapser right there. Oh, they come back though. Not that it would uh, do me a bunch of good. Okay, so this one we're going to make sure we hang right. Ah, finally a Dark Souls bonfire. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. No way I can make that. Nope. There's a power here. Or somewhere. And it's probably here because I keep seeing a lot of the... If you see one thing, that's, uh, that's, that's just a thing. If you see two, it's a coincidence. If it's three, it's kind of deliberate. <laughs> okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Heal up, heal up. Alright, very cool, very cool. So, I kind of thought this area might be just walk in and there's a John Boss Man right there, but it doesn't seem to be the case. Alright, we've gotten olive seeds. What are these for? Planting olive trees. <laughs> a handful of seeds carefully pre preserved. The stones of the olives were mashed into an oily uh, unguent, essential to the bag of any healer. Hmm. Interesting. And there's something over there, too. But until we get this mystery power, we'll never know.
Okay. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh, so that's a one way deal, I see. Slick as hell. So now we have almost half of them. 19 would be half. Okay. Oh, it's our traveler friend. Penitente. Escuchad mi confesión. La cobardía echa sus raíces dentro de mí ante esta nueva prueba del milagro doloroso. ¿Qué somos los peregrinos? Sino pecadores que hemos elegido el caminar como la más amable de las penitencias. Oh. Dejad que mi espalda inclinada cubra mis lágrimas. Penitente, que no hagan callo vuestros oficios ni en el alma ni en el. Alright, well, I gotta figure out how to get him through here because I want to see him make it. Oh, fuck. Okay, I don't blame you. <laughs> uh, fuck that. What the hell was that? Well, alright, let's do it. Oh, but first. I remember I have a little thingy. So, what is this? Um, let's turn off the dash distance and turn on our flame resist thing. Some protection, but it's better than nothing. Against this. That's a freaky deaky looking thing right there. I'm terrible at dodging it, by the way. Okay, heal up. Heal up again. Alright, ooh, I thought I would have been able to get that, but... Alright, this one's for all the marbles. There we go. What the hell? Alright, hey. <laughs> Are you ready to come by now? Aquellos gritos me llenaron el alma de espanto. Habéis purgado mis miedos y auxiliado a este pobre peregrino de nuevo. No problem, dude. A pesar de haber elegido sendas diferentes, a vos y a este pecador nos espera el perdón al final, esté donde esté, cerca o lejos, en esta vida o al otro lado del sueño. Misericordioso corazón sea penitente. We got another toe here. Big toe made of limestone. What does this do? And this, um... The strong big toe left its mark on the secret roots. Adds extra thrust while in the air. Oh, I wonder. Maybe we'll uh, put that on here. Let's turn, turn off the mask here and put the big toe on. Well, that might help a little bit. And we got mother of mothers here. Alright, oh, I remember. It's interesting that uh, contiguous areas usually won't share the same enemies, but you will see enemies repeated across some different areas. So I guess that's a good way to not have to redo the whole thing and also keep a little variety in it. Alright, we can't both of them with this right there. Yeah, that's pretty good. Alright, there you go. One more on him. There's a bunch of these fellas. Not for long, though. Got to hit every one of these candelabras. Hey, Woodcastle, uh, 73. Oh, thanks. Uh, welcome to the stream. How you doing? <laughs> All right, not of the three words. Oh, we got another prayed you. And ooh, what is this guy up to? El nudo de las tres palabras. Aquí ocurrió el primer milagro. This is the is this the narrator? alta voluntad ser castigado. Colocó un tronco de madera donde se apostó y rezó. Rezó esperando ser escuchado. Rezó para pedir dolor y así aliviar la gran culpa que se le clavaba afilada en el alma. Entonces, el milagro se manifestó. Le crecieron raíces en sus brazos y piernas que lo retorcieron, pero ningún lamento surgió de sus labios, ninguna queja. 
Todos los que habitaban estas tierras fueron testigos de aquello y todos rezaron ante la suplicada dicha interminable de aquel joven. Este árbol trino que brotó años después de su muerte fue llamado nudo de las tres palabras, pues tres son sus troncos anudados y tres fueron las únicas que pronunció el joven antes de morir. Mi gran culpa. Wow. Uh, looks like there's gold coming out of there. Cada año fluye de su interior oro líquido y ardiente, perpetuando su recuerdo y quizás para recordarnos que el primer milagro no nos ha abandonado. Pues nudosos son, fueron y serán los Golden Tree. Yeah, milagro. apparently uh, that guy was uh, there was somebody who was felt such guilt and he asked for a punishment to assuage his guilt and the miracle manifested himself or itself as a phenomenon and uh, made a golden tree El nudo de las colocó reflectó este arcada pues So this is a in a sense where it all started Yeah the the lore is kind of interesting in here They, there's a lot of little tidbits on, like every single item you can hit Y or whatever button and get a little bit more lore about stuff. They had fun writing this, I'm sure. Okay, so gotta watch out for, okay, the flash, there's gotta be a double, well no, that lever will pull that ladder down, that's, that's, a, that's a different story right there. Okay, um, we got a library of the negated words. I hear them reading. They mutter the forbidden writings. It is a constant murmuring whose echoes, once inside my mind, refuse to leave. I know that my curiosity will kill me if my madness does not do it first. Relatable. <laughs> All right. Oh, these guys, are they going to attack me? Are they just kind of doing their thing or what? Should I be attacking? No, they're. you can't attack them, but they can get you. Okay, I see. Just gotta, you know, dot dodge, roll slide, all that good stuff. I'm blocking these stacks of books. Oh gosh, there's a head and a collar. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, it's gonna keep coming. I see. Well, I guess I better take care of that. Throw the book at him. <laughs> Alright, heal up. Alright, move that. Okay. Oh, you son. <laughs> ah, they got me. Well, how am I going to get back up there? Maybe it returns automatically. Or maybe I have to hit the ladder again. That was a fall, yeah, for sure. Let's hit the... Okay. So, hey, you know what? That might work out. Okay, okay. Oh, no, no, no. These heads are just like... <laughs> they're gonna get me. Pull the lever, Kronk. Alright, don't get... Don't fall for it again. There we go. I think we're all right now. Now if I can get rid of this weird head creature here. It's just got a bag of heads, it looks like. Oh, I need to be <laughs> watch my health bar a little closer. All right, what's in this side here? Uh, just some ghosts kind of chilling out and reading. Oh, we got another prey Jew. Oh, who's this feller? This is a bloodborne looking guy. El sonido no cesa. Recta sobre estos muros olvidados, sin que nadie pueda determinar su procedencia o su ignoto destino. He's got a lot of keys on that ring. Por amor a la alta voluntad, a 
hacerlo callar, pues lo ansío desde hace tiempo. What the <gasps> Sorry. I, uh, I didn't quite make it there. Por amor. Well, I guess we'll find out what's going on here. Oh, I wish I could shoot up a little bit more. Oh. Ooh, okay. <laughs> this is the part where we take a lot of damage. I guess that's why they put that, uh, trade you there. I'm gonna take care of these before I go for any lever or anything. And also these heads. Man, I wonder if those fluffy collars couldn't have been that comfortable. <laughs> but I guess, you know, gotta suffer for style. There we go. Alright, now we got half of them. That's beautiful. Alright, do not fall for the trick. Oh, I, you know what? I'm going to try my power out here. Wait, what, how do I, what did, I, I, for, <laughs> I forgot how to even do them. Because I never use the magic. All right, well, we took care of that. That's, that's enough of that. Uh, we've acquired the Sacrum of the Dark Warlock, founder of the Library of Neglect, Negated Words. This priest was known by the sobriquet of the Dark One. He was caught practicing sorceries, surrounded by pagan writings. Uh-oh. Wait, are we... No, we got plenty of bones to go, looks like. Alright. Oh, so I almost fell off right there. What is the command to pull a spell down? Right button? No, that's parry. It's left trigger, okay. Oh, what's, uh, not until we get that double jump, quote-unquote. <laughs> There's got to be one. All right, this is where you can get your, uh, guilt assuaged, if I had any. <laughs> All right, I'm going to die here. And you needed the, uh, superpower to get in there. Uh, what was this? We've already, this is where we came from. Double jump would be nice to have, absolutely, yeah. Yeah, there's just too many uh, little places where it would totally solve all the problems that I have a feeling that there must be a double jump. Man, I was taking a lot of a lot of hits right there. Perhaps I should just move on. There we go. Nicely cleaned up. All right, downward attack definitely worked on him. <laughs> Part of me is like, oh, I don't want to go too far because I'm just going to die anyway. But, you know, if we can discover some more of the map, that's good. Yeah, we made it. All right, what does this do? Moves us over there. <laughs> you know, I guess it is kind of... Uh, I guess it's kind of good to get it out of the way, the dying part. Alright, so where did we die? Down there. So we're going to go left and down as much. Yeah. Yeah, but we'll be alright. Tis but a scratch. That downward attack works pretty well. I hate having to deal with these heads again, though. But if we can manage to stay alive, we'll be all right. All right, so was it... Yeah, this will work. I almost got hit by the book. Ooh. Really got to work on my dodge game. Or parrying, anyway. Because this is... This ain't cutting it. <laughs> Taking way too many hits. He threw the hook at me, yeah. <laughs> Good to see, Wiz. 
Okay. Seriously, though. The books hurt. Yeah, they sure do. I mean, look at this. I'm barely anywhere, and I've lost most of my health, most of my vials. It's just a... It's a rough road, but we're back here. We got our guilt fragment soon. There we go. So, not bad. Not bad at all. Well, it's a little bad, but it's not that bad. Alright, can we bring it over? Okay. Okay. So this is where it started, I guess. Yes. Curious that. Mm, I thought that was going to be a, a parry for sure. There we go. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, shit. So, gotta go back over here and get that. So, just be, just be ready for it, I suppose. Haha, <laughs> gotcha. Uh oh. Oh, I hate these kinds of enemies. Oh, God. Oh, that, okay. So, it wasn't too bad. Yeah, there's other worse ones for sure. Alright, nothing here worth seeing. Okay, let's see. What do we got? So, this is a secret path because we have a, a power equipped to do these. But, until I get the power to get into those brambles, I'm not going to do me much good. Oh, I, I can just kind of chill on the ground there and do it. Absolutely. All right, you know what? <laughs> Let's just get out of here. Come on, come on! Hundreds of years learning the mega laser spell only to be cut down in seconds. Yeah. <laughs> I guess he should have studied harder. Okay, this one is gonna kill me for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, okay, that's got. He's. Looks like he's just tossing a deer around. Alright, interesting. Poor deer. Oh dear, yes. <laughs> Lever crunk. Went all off offense. No, yeah. You know, he, he kind of died. Oh, gosh. I'm about to get uh, killed here. Is there anywhere? Hopefully, this is one of those places where you can. Well, whatever. We're just going to take our death as it comes to us. Yeah. But see, I bet if I got hit by that, it would really hurt quite a lot. So. Well, if we can get this power before I die, I guess it'll be... Nope. <laughs> this is where the laser studies are going to pay off. Okay, I got I got grazed a little bit. Okay, here! Oh, my goodness. Hmm. That's how you build Dark Souls characters? <laughs> Alright. Can I get to this? Probably not. No. Yeah, the health. I'm about as low as it can possibly go, but it was all according to plan. <laughs> Just a pixel. That's all a good gamer needs, really, you know what I'm saying? I'm kidding. <laughs> Planned, yeah, yep. <laughs> oh, these guys are like golden or something. Best Dark Souls characters, one hit equals dead. Yep. It's like, just don't get hit. It's really that easy.
<laughs> okay, we got hit on that one for sure. There we go. Oh, that was close. Okay. What's up here? Another bone, perhaps? We have acquired sooty garlic. <laughs> A dark bulb covered in black dust. Its finding is an omen of good luck, since it only grows as the first fruit on burned grounds. It is said to soothe many aches when used in a tisane. Although few dare to try it. Will you try the sooty garlic? Yeah, why not? So we're going to have to take this back to Albero. Or, yeah. They'll probably want that. that sounds like something they'd uh, be interested in. I'm going to go ahead and take care of this painting, too, so I can explore at my leisure. All right, is this one going to... Yep. Should have known. Bye-bye. It cannot be. I could have sworn the candle depicted in that painting was lit, and that was the room gleamed. Could I be losing my mind? Okay. Ooh, that looks dangerous. That'll probably one-hit kill you. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, boy. We're in the thick of it now. Oh, wait, what? it doesn't one hit kill. Thank goodness. <laughs> oh, I hate these things. Heal up. Heal. Oh, my God. Heal up. Heal up. Heal up. Heal up. Ooh, boy. Hey, Angela. Good to see you. All right. Wow, I'm getting uh, clowned on right now. <laughs> We made it through. And our favorite seller, but I'm going to talk to this right here. I am fearful. The little one stopped crying as soon as we placed him in the arms of that wicker woman, as if it were his mother. Sometimes I can't help but think there's something living in that wicker. Something, it seems to be rocking him in the darkness. Hmm. The miracle works in strange ways. Alright, what she got? <laughs> She says that about uh, everything she sells. <laughs> Alright, a wicker knot. Bead braided in a spiral motion, covered with a light coat of varnish that has protected it from the wear and tear of the years. A mother's hands work these strands and bless them. Their influence provides protection from toxic damage. Uh, uh 4,000? No. No es algo por lo que la campa. Uh, empty vial vessel for nine thousand. God damn. Uh, yeah, okay. Wait, hold on. I want to see what else you got. But I'll probably buy that. Because... aquí la envidia de los mercaderes. El tesoro más grande que ha pasado por mis manos jamás. Oh, it's the best thing she got. me paren los cursos y os miento. The key of the Inquisitor. Uh, master key forged from steel. The heart of the sword carried the great inquisitor announced his arrival even through the coldest uh, for 10,000 gold minus one. Yeah, you know what? I don't know what this does. I don't know if I need it. I've got other things I could spend it on. But sometimes you got a ball. Sometimes you got a ball. Alright. Alright. So uh, hopefully that'll be useful at some point. <laughs> Fuck it, we ball. Exactly. Baller! <laughs> Okay, so you can't... That, that's going to have to be a jump on this one right here. And they do provide helpful little platforms, but... What's up here? Usually I try to explore higher areas and lower. Okay, ooh, another a, a bone per chance. We're going to have to slide back through. Okay, wow. Um, Alright, why not? Ooh, I stood up too soon or something. 
Alright, let's uh, do that right there. That restored a lot of health. Maybe I did too. Okay, stop hitting me, guys. Seriously. This is going to be like some um, St. Flibbert's uh, left thigh bone. Oh, more Quicksilver. Okay, that is actually kind of handy. Of course, the problem with Quicksilver is you've got to sacrifice one of your bile vessels for it. Now, if I bought that other one instead of spending it on whatever I... this weird key, that would be one thing, but... Though I'm sure I'll, I'll get some more tears here at some point. I'll get some for just taking this garlic back. Well, finally. I always like to see a, a double back gate unlocked right there. Alright, so next we're going to the right. Also, we should have gone left. I'm not saying it's... Uh, well... We'll see. Because I'm kind of curious if that was... Uh, uh, this will lead back. It probably will. Do we have the ability to go through there? That's the question, though. Alright, what do we got? And another bead of wax, I think. Or a candle. A big bead of blue wax. We got them big blue beads of wax. So the, okay, so our wax gets bigger every time. Tiny pebble of melted wax of a dusted cerulean. The cries from tortured zealots still reverberate inside, and it slightly strengthens the wearer's fervor. Well, how about that? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, we'll put it back on. Why not? Can't get this yet. Maybe if I could double jump. <laughs> uh, the kneecap of Sebastian, the puppeteer. Sebastian Wodja. I think that's a Polish name. Uh, lived surrounded by puppets. To him, they were his family. His, his cries uh, marked the night. He disappeared into the flames of his theater, exclaiming, I forbid, forbid you to move. Oh, wow. Ooh. <clears throat> so there's another uh, gated area that we got back. Lovely. And access to a teleporter, so I think I'll go ahead and use that. <clears throat> Alright, what's through the door here? Alberto. So we got a couple things we can do here. We can, uh... Well, I was gonna do that, but I, I lost my, uh... I lost the tears, so I don't have 8,000 anymore. But I can still, uh... We can still have a little fun. So where's this guy wanting the garlic? Right here. Upstairs before I... Oh, we have olive seeds and garlic. Hell yeah. Misericordioso sea impenitente. Vuestra aportación la obra de esta cofradía continúa. So that was a uh, 5,000 tears right there. That's pretty pretty clean. And here, have some sooty garlic. Misericordioso sea impenitente. Con vuestra aportación la obra de esta cofradía continúa. Oh my god, dang. That's like 10,000 right there. So I think the rewards must get bigger every time. Which is cool. Look, there's two cats about ready to fight up on the roof there. I didn't notice that before. Alright, let's go ahead and turn these bones in too. I've only got one or two maybe, but uh, anything helps. And I can probably go get that... Uh, sword ability that I was looking at, and have a little spare for uh, that bile vessel. Mirad. Mirad como brota la ceniza bajo nuestros pies. Desde el otro lado de la puerta, los huesos... So I, I guess if we get all these bones, we can open that door. Nos cante de nuevo. Oh, su dulce. All right, dude. <laughs> uh, hmm. So, Quicksilver guy's here. Do we want to do that? 
Yeah, let's let's do it. One of them. I won't do both because that'd be a little much. But um, I think generally, if you can have a bigger one, it'll it's better because it'll take less time to uh. So we need three thousand. Yeah, let's do it. And I'll just yeah, buy another one here, yeah. pretty shortly. Con esta plata yo bendigo la mixtura que recuperará vuestra sangre derramada. All right, so we'll we'll get that other bile flask, and uh, that's gonna be what ten thousand, nine thousand, yeah, nine nine thousand. So unfortunately, we won't be able to get the sword ability, but. Uh, I think it's better to have the the bile for sure, or the um, what you call it. Look at the top of his head. Yeah, it's like shaved in the middle there. <laughs> he, he was he kind of was going for a friar tuck sort of thing, but kind of wimped out. <laughs> oh no no no! No 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 no! Yeah, that haircut is not very fresh. All right. uh... Oh yeah, I, I guess I do have a lot of little redeems there. Uh, let's see what we got. So next, let's go back to the teleporter. And what's through here? So, actually I need to look at a map first so I can kind of get at my bearings. Um, so we're looking for a one that's close to that and I'm not seeing one actually it's kinda of weird because usually you would expect there might be um, he clergy a little hard yeah he clergy a little hard do I like paperback or hardcover books um, I guess it depends if it's not a very thick one I paperback but if it's like a big thick book I think hardcover is probably better. Because uh, they can kind of fall apart under the, uh, under the own weight of their their pages, I suppose, is a way to put that. Yeah, so like a big one, hardcover, but something that's just uh, sort of light reading or short, I think uh, soft cover is just fine. Also like uh, ebooks a lot too, and audiobooks. Most of what I listen to or read, quote unquote, is audiobooks these days. Uh, let's see. So I think the best shot we got is gonna be where? I th wait. I saw one over here. I thought. Also, I probably need to. Exp well, I, if I had a better jumping ability that would be one thing man they, they kind of put these out of the way but I guess we won't do anything we'll try to get back to the salt area or I just won't I haven't even bought the thing so why am I worrying about that right now let's go back to mercy dreams yep Uh, let's see, well, the grievance of sins, probably. No. Luckily, the teleporter works pretty quickly. Silent Sorrow, Mercy, yeah, there we go. I'll go ahead and buy that, and, th and if I come across her again, I'll be able to uh, just go ahead and upgrade it. Actually, I don't even know where the store is. <laughs> Could it be up here? Well, I'm glad I explored left, but now we need to go further right. And it was just a double back, but we can go further on that other side. It's easy to kind of forget little bits and pieces. Go ahead and take advantage of this. What do we got? Uh, let's go all the way right and see if we can get anything out of there. 
I'm gonna try to just kind of skip these guys if possible. I, I probably should try to take a few of them out just because... Uh, okay, so I can't make it past this guy without killing him, apparently. So I gotta do it. And that's when the decision to let these guys slide kind of hits me in the back. Okay, whoa. Alright, cool magic spell, by the way. <laughs> okay. Alright, yeah, let's, let's see what we got here. We got uh, three paintings. Oh, and there were some ghosts on the ground that were talking about that, but... I forgot what they said. So... Yeah, this is some secret or side quest thing. What? Uh, so the so, okay. So the, wow, these guys hit hard. All right, watch out for those paintings, guys. <laughs> Which will you take, the red candle or the blue candle? <laughs> Eat this wax. But in that painting, the uh, the blue candle was lit and the red was not. Also, I know there's a candle. There's a, I, I, I've seen like two or three of the blue candles around where I get the balls of wax from. But there's one red candle that I know of in the uh, desecrated cisterns. You know, I'm gonna try to parry this guy. Okay, that didn't work. That, well, let's try again. All right, that did work, but the knockback. Oh my gosh! Of course, that's a big thing to be swinging around. Okay, whoa! Get our guilt fragment back. Take care of these paintings so they don't take care of me. Very blue candle to me. Yep. Whoa! I don't know how I didn't get hit by that one. If I well, the spike pits are the worst. <laughs> See what I mean? That's that's what really gets the the damage right there. And by damage, I mean instant death. So we're gonna have to kill this thing again. Oh well. At least the paintings die pretty quickly, even if they do hit hard. Really, you could just throw a match at him, I feel like, and kind of take care of him. Alright, so let... Okay, wow. My dodging is not dodging. Throw paint thinner on them, yep. <laughs> then they'll run away. Ouchies. Alright, we're gonna parry this one. And it knocks you back so far that you can't really get and take advantage of it. See, if I could just jump over this guy, it'd be one thing, but I have to sit here and actually kill him. All right, run, 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 run. Oh, execute. Oh, that's that's metal. Now we can peacefully go up here. Did I even... No, I didn't. Well, I did, actually. I did make it over there. I just didn't last long. <laughs> Alright, just don't give him a chance to kill you and it'll be alright. No, 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 no. 
Okay, I should maybe I should crouch down. I wonder if that would even help. That was just a few pixels off, right? Yeah, <laughs> that, they got me good on that one. Stay away. Ah, wait, no, he, he got me. There we go. Alright, I took a lump, but that's okay. Oh, shit! Nope, nope, nope. If I don't fall off, I can skip these paintings. Alright, one more time. This time, well executed. There we go. Alright, he's taken care of. Get her... Nervous about this one. Okay, no, don't put me in the damn spike pit again. Please, no. Anywhere but the spike pit. <laughs> Fucking hell, dude! Alright, whatever. We're running for it. And we gotta deal with his ugly ass again. Since we don't have those uh, statue guys on us, it won't be so bad though. Oh yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. Oh, oh, I hate this son of a bitch right here. Tell you what we're going to do, though. We're going to turn off this ball of wax right here. And we're going to put on our gold mask, which is a little bit of fire resist. We are so back, yeah. <laughs> Alright, uh, if I can manage to not get up. Man, that's a, what an ugly looking enemy. I'm sure it's a uh, mother thinks it's cute, but... Just jump into the fireball, why don't ya? Bing! Alright, last, last leg here. Hopefully we'll find something cool out of this. I jumped into it again! It's like they know I'm gonna do it! Oh, that... All right, I gotta kill this thing before it kills me. Ah, it killed me. <laughs> yeah, I, I just, it's like, mm. dodge into the attack. All right, gotta do this faster somehow. All right, I've, I've set myself up for failure already because I didn't kill the paintings. Also, I'm kind of regretting selling that other thing for the Quicksilver. I don't know if it was actually worth it. Oh, that was a waste. That's okay. Alright. I'm gonna make sure these guys stay down. Ah! <laughs> as soon as I say that, he gets up. There, take your remote attack. I wish they gave a little more... Uh, visual indication they were going to stand up before they actually do. But I guess it's a, you can't really dodge something if it happens right where you're standing. Alright, thank goodness I didn't fall down there again. Alright, so the secret for this one, if you can truly say there is a secret, is uh, apparently you got to crouch in the middle, and that's going to save you a little bit of pain. Not too much necessarily, but just enough. Or you can just uh, commit to it and go through, which I think worked a lot better. <laughs> That platform in the middle was kind of a, a red herring. Alright, come on now. Ah! 
Ah, I saw him, I saw him start to telegraph it, but I fell for it. There we go. Alright, next time, we're gonna do it much better. Of course, that Hell Beast, or whatever it's called. Don't like that thing much at all. Alright, this time, we're totally not gonna get burned on, are we? Ah, oh, we are. We took... <laughs> And the fuck! Stop dodging into the projectiles. All right, you know what? I'm just gonna brute force it. Forget it. Whatever. So that did not unlock the gate. That's very curious. I guess we'll have to pull a lever upstairs or something. Oh my! And of course, they get you when you're down. Okay, I no no no. Sometimes you just gotta commit to it. Hesitate and will get you killed on the mean streets of Custodia. Nope nope nope. <laughs> All right. I wish there was like a, a mid-air dodge like you have in Waka Melee. Of course, and the fact that it has the knockoff or knockdown damage too, that really sucks. If you could just stay there and, you know, take your take your hit, that'd be one thing, but oh god. Actually what I need to be doing is probably thinking about hanging off a ledge or two, you know? Yeah, you know what I mean? Yep. Oh my goodness. I don't want to die here again. But it's looking less and less likely that I make it. Alright, just take it. Actually, just heal up first. Alright. I cannot take another one of these hits. Ah! <laughs> Oh, so now they they had me they had me figure it out. They thought, oh, I just okay. Actually, that probably would work if you were fast enough, but I'm not. Looks like I'm gonna be coming back here again. Unless, sorry if I'm not saying much, but I'm trying to think here. Okay, the, so there's. It looks like there's a a boss right beyond that door cuz that lady only shows up if there's a boss nearby. So that means there's probably a prey you up there, which would be nice. Oh fucking hell. <laughs> ah. Well, if you do it once, you can do it again, I guess. But okay, that was clean. That was clean. Oh yeah. It's all coming together. <laughs> Alright, that's not coming together right there, though. Curse of... <laughs> hey, Mug. Oh! Or Curse of my... <laughs> I can't even read all that. Oh, it's the Curse of Raw, maybe? Or... <laughs> hey, Led. Hey, Trayno. It's the curse. We're getting cursed so hard right now. I'm about to get my head chopped off here. You want to sip? Sure thing. You got it. Alright. We're going to need that sip to get past these blades. Alright. Here's the plan. Survive. God damn. Oh, man. Oh, wait, wait. It's so not over yet. It could be over. It's hypothetically over. But we're not sure yet. It was over. As it turned out. <laughs> All right, we'll, we'll, we'll come back. All right. 
So I, I do need to kill these paintings, because when I don't, it ends up worse for me. Alright, hit the golden guy. I never asked for this. Uh, yeah, let me tell you. <laughs> you tell him, Jensen. See, if I could just jump past this guy, it'd be so much faster, but I gotta kill these. And they got a lot of health. And they're little golden buddies here. We're just gonna sit here and swing until this guy steps up. There we go. Alright, there you go. Oh, don't fall for it. One more time. Uh, two more times. Oh, wait. My controller's time to spawn. Alright, can we... Don't we... Yeah, okay. I was about to say don't get greedy, but it worked out that time. Sometimes... Oh, shit. I hate this. We're going to fall for the paintings again. Unless I can get out of here. Which is uh, maybe possible. We, uh, we made it. Okay. So here we go. Watch out for the... I, there's got to be a name for these swimming, swinging blades. I'm not sure what it is, though. Okay, execute. Alright, in this one, I remember... The trick is to not try and rest on that central platform. And just go for it. Well, I kind of timed it wrong, but... Whatever, we got through it. Alright, so let's take our hits right here. Deal with this guy. Alright, a little faster this time. Of course, this, uh, this one guy, really annoying enemy with the fireballs. Hopefully I don't jump straight in, like, see, like that. <laughs> Alright, come here. Oh, ouch. Alright, I'm going to use a spell, but I don't ever use them, so... There we go. That made it a little easier. Alright, heal up. Alright, now we got the timing close on that last time. Just need to do it perfectly. We're good enough. Okay, that's, uh... <laughs> we're having a time. Oh! I got too close to the edge. I edged too hard. Alright, let's see... Gimme, give gimme. Give Alright, oh, no, 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 no. Edge maxing, yep. It's a fine line, but you gotta ride it. <laughs> Alright. Hey, come on here. Alright, up and over. Up and over. I'm gonna check this out. Maybe there's a preview. There he is. There he is. It'd be kind of weird if there weren't. With that boss lady there. The moon is out tonight with long-tailed gown. And a bull stares at her in between the rock rows and the shadows. A bull, you say? Literally. Habéis encontrado algunos de mis hermanos. Aunque todavía os pido encontrar a los demás. Guardad mientras este lienzo. Hecho con el oro de nuestros rostros. Y los hermanos os guiarán. Hmm. I hate the devil rap so much. <laughs> oh God. Penitente, al encontrar a estos santos hermanos, habéis completado la visión de mi alumbramiento, que fue pintada en un lienzo que se encontraba dormido. That's quite a quite a birth there. Siendo jocinero mi nombre, nací de la luna. It's a baby. It's a little baby. <laughs> that just sawed its way out of a bull here. And we got a linen of a golden thread. Nice. So what does this do? Uh, the product of a spinning wheel that only turned on full moon... Oh, so... Hmm. They don't, they don't spin a lot once a month, I guess. This uh, thin thread was plated to... Excuse me. Immortalize its progeny. Bestowed as a gift by the firstborn. It allows the penitent one... Penitent one... To descend into the bottomless abysses. Oh, that sounds cool. So if there's a... 
the bottomless abyss that you die in, uh, turn that on. And you'll find some cool stuff, perhaps. Uh, since you can swap that out at will, I will, uh, I will wait to do so later. Okay, okay, no, no. Not like this. Oh, and that means that thing's gonna be back. Probably. I... What? I wonder why it... I guess those are only one-time deals, because... Normally, the, uh, pre is... It respawns everything. Er, it respawns everything. Abby's claimed to be the, uh, Mazacord and Kiss-Off champion. What do you have to say about this? Um... I don't know. I... <laughs> maybe. I'd have to judge the evidence. Who got the most Mazo kisses in uh, 2023? That'd be, uh, have, you'd have to review the footage on that one. Alright, let's see. Ooh. Cal's death. <laughs> I don't know, Ozzy might have it, uh, we'll have to see. A challenger approaches, <laughs> yeah. Ouch! I'm getting hit on so bad right now. That damn blade just kills me. Alright. And that gap is just a little bit too wide. Leave this man's alone. <laughs> Alright, come on. Through. Okay, alright, alright. There we go. As th that gap is just a little much. Alright, and she is always asking, Do you want me to help you? And I always say, No, I can do this myself. So, there's a boss pass or past here. Almost certainly. Exposito, Scion of Abjuration, which is a kind of magic in a lot of games. Certainly looks like a boss room, yeah. What the hell? <laughs> Alright, looks like a... Oh my god. What is a kiss-off champion? Um, I, get, uh, I don't know if it's a volume, or is it a quantity or a quality thing? That's a question. <laughs> it's a... It's crying, and it's got this weird... Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> fireballs. I hate fireballs. They get me every time. Alright, so the last boss I got first try, which was the only one I have first tried in this game. This one, I don't think it's going to end up so nice for me. But we're going to try. We're going to do our best, damn it. Okay, heal up, heal up. Send them devils to hell. <laughs> Alrighty, we'll do. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Gotta say though, it's looking a little rough. Alright, uh, it's gonna rain down on me in a second. Okay, ouch. There's, uh, you know, there wasn't really much I could do about that right there. Alright. So we gotta make this jump again. But, thankfully, there is a little respawn point right there. So. Uh, they, uh, the game does have the... <laughs> the niceness to put one in front of every boss battle. It was a baby. Yep. Just a little baby with a weird parasitic thing. Alright, get our guilt fragment back. Alright, this time it's going to be different. Looks like there's some weird bramble thing. Oh, there was some lore about this, actually. Um, some A dead body was talking about how the baby stopped crying when it was put in the wicker thing's arm. Almost like it was his actual mother. Weird. Alright. Alright, watch out for the- Fuck! <laughs> okay, this might be a long one here. Might have to take a few <laughs> few times on this boss here. Okay, okay, okay. Something about fireballs, just I, I, I run into them. He said, watch out for the fudge. Ah.
every time. Well, not every time. I, I only got hit by one of them that time. <laughs> Alright, I need to get out of dodge here. Can't resist the lure of a fireball. Yeah, totally. Alright, I'm going to check and look at my powers here. and see if there's anything that I can possibly improve on them. Because I got a feeling. And also, I it might be worth looking for another bio vial, but we'll see. I'll hold off on that. We won't, we definitely want the fire. Uh, I can turn off the Eye of Iridition for now. Uh, let's see what we got. The Big Toe. I got the Big Toe. So Fervor. I might be using the Fervor a little more. Uh, toxin Protection. Wait, actually, I, I didn't buy the other Toxin Protection. That's right. What does this do? Nothing. Um... Uh, magical nature attacks? Yeah, sure. Let's turn off the... Well, no, I want this, actually. Who put this massively fat baby here in the first place? I mean, uh... Yeah, it's like... What's up with that? What's the deal with fat babies and boss fights? It's like, I could take her assistance, but I've held off on it so far, so... I think I'll, uh... I think I'll just... Keep bashing my head against the wall until the wall breaks, or I do. <laughs> Maybe best not to, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this weird centipede creature, that's what I want to know about, really. It's kind of, well, I, I could say it's kind of creepy, but about half the enemies in this game are kind of creepy. It's kind of the point, I think. <laughs> Alright, this time it will be different. Ah, it was different. We we made it that time. I, I gotta savor my victory. Okay, don't fall for the spiky thing either. Alright, well we got hit once on that one. Uh, I'll hold off on the heal just, just for a second more. See, I, I can't be too timid. I gotta take some hits where I can get them, you know? All right, slowly, slowly, slowly. Really, the true power of the attacks is in the combos. So if I can get some combos on them, it'd be a lot better. Without getting hit, that'd be nice. Okay, all right, we took the hit there. We took a couple hits there. We took a lot of hits there. Come on here. What have the... Ah, ah. Alright, we're, we got up, well, halfway down, but he got us more than halfway down, so... And a lot of times there's a different stage. Oh my god, see what I'm talking about. A different stage of the boss fight. This one is going to, yeah, that's that's going to kill me big time. Major big time. All right, we just wasted our last healing vial. Well, didn't use it wisely. And there's this, well, don't attack the baby per se. That might be a little much. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, watch. Oh, god damn. All right, so this thing actually does damage. What a surprise. All right, watch. Ooh, shit. You know, on one hand, these things are annoying, but at the other hand, at least they're not fireballs. Uh, give the baby a break. They already removed his eyeballs. Oh, yeah, I hadn't even really thought about that. That's kind of rough right there. Listen, you can't be removing baby's eyeballs like that, all right? It's just not very Christian of you. All right. Oh, wait, did I just get fucking eaten? <laughs> I got ripped in half by a baby. All right, you know, fuck that baby. Whatever. <laughs> the little thing ripped me in half. <laughs> all right, it's nap time.
That's a strong... Yeah, surely. It's just like, oh, you've got steel armor on? That's nice. Rips you in half. <laughs> Ripped it. Yeah. That's straight out of doom here. Alright, watch out for that. I thought I'd get a free hit on him. Did not. Alright, whoa, wee, bub. Alright, take our attacks. Oh, I can just stay here and cheese. Well, it's not really cheesing, probably, but. Oh yeah, that's some damage right there. New strat, yeah, for sure. That's that's worth it right there. I mean, we're taking a lot of damage, but at the same time, we're uh, and the. <laughs> All right, so that's that's the problem. I well, I did, and then he ripped me in half. So when I when I and the baby gets well, when the enemy gets a little about less than half health, I think, the, and then the baby gets a little hungry, and uh, <laughs> and the, the, the I I become the airplane. Tough, yeah, for sure, for sure. But for the first half of the fight, that worked like a treat. I don't know if it'll ever work again, but we're going to try it out. Alright, well, <laughs> get our first hit out of the way. I wonder if it works on this side, too. Probably not. Maybe. Oh, it's not going so hot this time. Alright, watch out for the fireball. Got hit by him. Yeah, damn! Alright, don't stand exactly there. Yeah, here we go. Alright, whoa, that, nope, 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 nope. Nope, nope. Alright. I think shit just worked out better. Okay, so we're half health now. Now we gotta watch out for this stupid fucking baby. <laughs> Alright. I'm sorry, baby. I didn't mean to call you stupid. Alright, don't get hit like that. That's not working. Oh my god. We're making progress though, I feel like. I'm just paranoid about getting ripped in half again. It's very unpleasant, let me tell you. Super baby can't even drive a car. You yeah, t tell me about it. All you can do is just sit there and cry and <laughs> rip, <laughs> rip me in half with your bare hands, with your bare baby hands, like I'm a graham cracker or something. Oh yeah, there we go. That's uh, that's what I'm talking about right there. See, I like how there's a little section in the middle there. It's like kind of green. So you can get a if you can get your things lined up, it'll double it up. See where baby don't even know a good Mega Million spread. Yeah, it's like, come on, <laughs> you're never gonna win like that. <laughs> Were you born yesterday or something? No, that no, that baby wasn't born yesterday. Got too much hair for that, but all right. Gotta be. <laughs> I think that's uh that's when you're still pregnant. The trimesters are. All right. This drum music's kind of intense. Forty-eight weeks. Oh, 
Well, how about that? All right, now I gotta watch out because this thing's gonna eat me. It's like the reverse fat bastard scenario, you know, where he's gonna eat the baby, get in my belly. I'm bigger than you. I can eat you. No, this baby's gonna eat me. This is the run. All right, well, if you say so. <laughs> You do have a pretty good record calling them. Of course, I don't. Oh, there we go. It was a run. Every time, Wiz. Every time. <laughs> oh, fuck. Baby back, baby back, baby back. Ribs. Chilies. Baby back, ribs. Barbecue sauce. Yep. <laughs> Baby yeeted successfully, yep. Let's pull up our little elevator here. Or pull it down, I guess. Also, since I have this, I can see some secret paths. Let's see what's up here. I don't have a double jump, so I can't get up here. There's gotta be a double jump somewhere. Wait, I no. You gotta think. You gotta think. <laughs> I like chilies because they had spicy kids pasta meal, but I don't know if they have it anymore. I don't know either. I've only eaten at Chili's one time in my life, I think. It was alright. So yeah, there almost definitely gotta be a double jump or something. And these are finally open. Alright, so I have been here before. Well, I've sort of been here before. Wish I had a fat bastard emote and only have Dr. Evil for some reason. I'm surprised you got a Dr. Evil emote. <laughs> but yeah, they should be a fat bastard emote. Alright, Virtua Mea Culpa hath ascended. And look at that, we've got so many of these tiers right here. Um, I was going to get this one, but this one looks even cooler. So I'm going to get that one. Have no idea why you have it. Hmm. Um, so this one would also be cool, but... I'm going to hold off on it. Because I want to save some of this for other things. Alright, we got that lever pulled. Oh, what you got for me here? I've acquired the embossed mask of Crescente. Alright. An artifact found in the hands of a dead archdeacon in a dusty library. Huh. Well, we'll see what it does. It's called Paper Pals Cheesy Chicken Pasta now. Pepper Pals. I said, I don't know say paper. Uh, they don't have red sauce option on the menu anymore. I guess, did you like the red sauce one more? I mean, pepper and cheese are just a great combo, in my opinion. Nothing happened. Huh. Well, I know there's a, another candle out there that is red also. Oh, you can't have dairy. Oh, yeah, you did mention that. Well, you said you keep lactate in your purse, I think, but... Alright, let's see. So up there is nothing, or something, but not... Not likely to be any. Well, let's. All right, let's try this out. We'll we'll find out for sure. All right, get knocked right off the ladder. Okay. Okay. We'll try again. This time without getting hit by the the weird book guy. Ah, uh, nope. I'm tempted to just go because I there's nothing for me to find there. I guess I've already been there. I don't know why I'm worrying about it. Alright, um... We could go up more. There does appear to be something up there that we haven't checked out. Like I said, I'm not sure what that boss was about and what that mask is for, but... I do know we're probably going to die on our way up here. Alright, let's check out the left side here. Oh, I remember now. Yeah, this section. And I haven't gone this way yet. 
Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, that's a very nice looking blade, I have to say. Nice and colorful. Of course, it's going to kill me. Oh, Lord. <laughs> We're getting sliced and diced on. Yeah. Probably should have tried to find a Prey Rave Blade, yeah. Imagine dying something like, like that. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta figure out how to get all the way back up there. Well, we got an elevator, so. Alright, watch out. And this boss chamber is nothing. Because we already killed the boss. The boss is already dead. Okay, whoa. Oh, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Let's, uh, let's, let's turn this on. So we don't need the fancy lung. Let's turn on this. Let's see what it lies at the bottom here. Oh, that's quite an entrance. We've acquired the nasal bone of Charles, the artist. The beauty of his work sparkled, or sparked a strong debate within the church. It was common, commanded that no representation could be more beautiful than life itself. Dryden's collection was confiscated, and he was forgotten. So many bones, yeah. Banished to oblivion and prey to these walls are some of the most valuable forbidden works of art. Oh, so we're gonna see the cool stuff now. This is where I keep the good shit. Alright, come through. Oh, goddamn. Well, at least when you kill these, they stay dead, so... It seems to be the case. Alright. Open up. Oh, wait. You have to do that. Oh, I see. That's it? <laughs> okay. I thought that was going to be cooler. Well, I guess we got a nasal bone out of it, so I guess that was worth it. Alright. Have I learned nothing from last time? <laughs> Apparently not. Okay, stop this. Stop this at once. <sighs> Sigh. Alright, so I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to follow this one immediately. And then get knocked back. And, and forget to jump. Naturally. Alright, so maybe there's a sweet spot in there. Right there. Alright, not quite. Not quite. I don't know why sometimes it seems so easy and sometimes it's, uh, it just really gets me. Alright, okay, oh, ah, well, you know what, I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. There we go, there we go, alright. Go ahead and stop at this, uh, Prey Jew here. Alright, what else we got? I'm not sure where to go next, so I guess I'll go up. See if we can get much higher. So high. <laughs> I really got to check this area out a little bit more. All right, left, right, up, down, center. We'll we'll go right because I want that guilt fragment back. And there, there clearly was something going on in that direction. Alright, so we'll just skip this, because like I said, we've already explored the upper reaches of this area. Pretty sure. Back up is that ladder. Mm, 
We'll go up. Alright, head right. Oh, rave blades. That's right, they're back. They're so back. Okay, wow. Okay, not... <laughs> ah, there you go. That's, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, I'll wait just a second before I heal up. Alright, so it seems like these guys, you really gotta parry him. Okay, ooh, oh my, oh, do you see how much damage that guy does? Then again, he's got a lot of hide on me, and that's a pretty spiky stick right there. Alright, watch this, get clowned on. Oh, wait, I'm kidding, I don't have the magic for it. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, let's get this guilt frag. Oh no, 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 no! <laughs> right, give me, give me a guilt fragment now, now, please. Oh no, guy, there you go. All right, all right. Might as well destroy some of these. All oh, these bell guys are kind of oh, clang. There's got to be another one around here somewhere. It's been a minute. Um, what's this way? More death and pain. Alright, so we are going to have to come back and check that right door out. But for now, let's just deal with this. I'm, I have not. I don't think I've seen these guys before. I don't think I like them. I bet getting hit by that really hurts if they only die in like three or four hits. Alright, so there's a power up or a bone up there or something like that. So let's check what that is. I gotta find a ladder, maybe. No, this this'll do it. Rave blade. Like I said, if you parry him alright, you'll have him, but. Of course, there's a ton of knockback on that. Oh god, look at my health. Damn. I was playing around. Alright, what was that? We have acquired the Consecrated Amethyst. A gem that gives off an intense aroma of incense. In the Mother of Mothers, the ornate incense burners were filled with precious gems and beads, consecrating them with their vapors. The Samethyst comes from the greatest of them all, and its blessing gives the wearer great protection against magical attacks. All right. So it looks like there's a uh, minor protection against magical attacks, which is this like closer sapphire, or not this one, but the little bell, the muted bell, and then there's the major one. Okay, so we're getting extra powered, and there's a major pr po uh, poison protection on that other lady and her store. If I ever go back to her, there we go. Die, die, die. Actually, why am I doing this? What I need to do is I need to turn this poison off. Or poison protection. I'm going to turn this eye on because I like being able to see the how long I've got to kill them. Alright, cool. Alright, that guy's not going to be too hard to deal with. How many more prayers does the great sensor want? When will it tire and stop swaying? When will we be able to stand up again? Lower your head, close your eyes, pray, and do not get up. Okay, so... Ah, I see. That thing will kill me if it hits me. <laughs> oh my god, see how it wiped them out. We're crouch moding on this one. Frog mode. Woo! That was... Oh my god, that was close. Like, should somebody stop this thing? Nah, it's probably fine. Man, if I don't get up here and attack... Okay. Really would like to find a parade you. Slide through. Alright. 
If I get hit again by anything, it's pretty much over. So I guess I'd better not do that. Alright, there. What's on the other side? Nothing for me. There's a baby. Alright, oh god, if we get hit. Alright, there's gotta be something around here, because this is gonna be a little bit of a hike now. I don't, yeah, nope. I should have done one over here, probably. So next time I come back up there, I will stop at the. Not of the three words, I suppose. Also, what's on the right side there? There should be a, a double run speed button or something like that. Would not trust babies no more after that baby battle. Yeah, let's get burnt once. <laughs> like, why does this guy act really terrified around babies? It's the weirdest thing. He acts like they're going to like reach up and rip him in half or something. Well, little do you know. Oh, in order to get up there, I would have to. So that's why I'm going to go this way. Yeah, yeah, that makes more sense now. If I can, actually. I can. I should be able to, anyhow. I never did explore this side. Oh, it's a teleporter. Is there anything up here? Like, no. But still, it's good to have that access. so many doors are just like right there and you don't even check them out because you got a lot on your plate as a, a uh, somebody passing out the penance here there's a lot of sin to be cleansed all right I did want to check out the left side here all right it was here yes it was oh so this X is a or does it? Oh no, there's one to the left there. We already uh, checked this out. This is one of the longer dialogue options. Alright, let's see. What do we got? So this will save us a little bit of walking if we die. Alright, take a sippy. A clang. <laughs> All right, and I can't get up there quite yet. So, did I want to take the stairs again, or do I... I might as well. All right. I'm going to skip this guy. Because it's just going to take a lot of extra time that I don't want to waste. Damn, they move fast, though. All right, what do we got? I could go up. I can't make it up there without that. We're just going to skip. Oh my god, damn. Alright, what? Uh, oh, let's go right. Let's go right. You know what? I didn't last time. Let's find out what's over here. This is a pretty big map, I have to say. And this is a separate area, it looks like, due to the color. Alright, stay here. Find out what's up here. Oh, nice this, uh, stained glass looks very pretty. Hello. She's got like horns. Interesting. Guerrero sin rostro, detened vuestros pasos. Puedo sentir. Is she floating a little bit too? A pesar de no veros el semblante u oíros la voz. Disculpad mis modales. Mi nombre es Miriam. Miriam. Este lugar de tinieblas granate me ha hecho llamar. 
Algo en esta tierra que Why sufre, fooler. Yep. <laughs> una voluntad que se escapa a mi comprensión, ha decidido que tomase un sendero diferente en mi viaje, haciéndome llegar a este lugar. Si ha permitido este encuentro, entonces es que estamos sometidos a una prueba, destinados a someternos game, maybe? Huh. bajo su mirada. Sip, you got it. Este cristal ante nosotros es lo que me permite viajar a lejanos lugares. Uh, traveling from distant lands, maybe. Mas ahora está fracturado, como podéis ver. Su magia no vive. If only could remember what it was. Hmm. Para restaurarlo necesito encontrar los fragmentos esparcidos por vuestro mundo. Por favor, permitidme enseñaros uno de ellos. Se encuentra tras esa puerta. I'll check it out. Oh, it's, it auto moves me. That's interesting. It rarely does this. They're placing a lot of stock on this Miriam character. She even got her own little cutscene. This might be part of the DLC. I don't know. Because I, I got the complete edition or whatever. fragmentos. Debo regresar a mi reino cuanto antes. All right, sure. <laughs> I'll jump into this uh, mysterious burning portal because this lady told me to. And now you can't leave. <laughs> oh wow, that platform looks really cool. Uh, oh yeah, this way. All right, pretty good so far. All right, what's down below? Uh, it'll take me there. Thank God. I was, I was hoping I didn't have to make a blind jump. I probably should have though. Probably should have stayed on. That's what I'm saying. Whatever. I've made my decision. All right, hit that. Grab the ledge. Grab that ledge. Slide through. Uh oh, I hear something stomping. It is a banging soundtrack. Yeah, I gotta say the music in this game is pretty good. <laughs> uh, she's from Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. Oh, is that? Is that another game this developer worked on? Or that it would be kind of cool. Yeah. <laughs> no way. I do like... This level has a lot of very strong forward momentum, I guess, if you want to call it that. It's also a Metroidvania. Well, that sounds cool. Maybe I'll have to play it. I do like me a good Metroidvania. All right. Now, I did say I was thinking about staying on that top one up there, but now I gotta know what's on the bottom here, so we're gonna do that. Then again, okay, there was nothing here. I was just curious. Oh, no, now it's gonna kill me. <laughs> so you didn't want to stay up there. Okay, okay. Okay, so I... I'm guessing the moral of that story is you need to keep moving. Guess what? The guy who made it was the assistant director of Symphony. Oh. Well, that's cool. That's uh, that's some good cred in the in the Metroidvania. I mean, that's part of the, that's part of the namesake right there. So. All right, but always be moving. Floor on the gas. Here, don't get spiked. Here we go. Alright, here we go. This is our platform. 
And don't fall upon that terrible whatever faith that beset me. <laughs> I was just a little off on that jump and it it paid it paid off. We'll say that. Alright, slide down. There's like a giant in there somewhere. Alright, oh god damn it. <laughs> uh. What the hell? How did I die? Yeah, I, I'm not sure what happened there. Time limits. Oh, I, I didn't even see the timer in the corner there. Holy shit. Oh, man. I'm blind as a bat, apparently. Or I guess I'm just not paying attention. I'm just tunnel visioning it. I, did, I didn't see the timer there. I've never seen a timer in this game. Okay. Right, in that case, we're moving. Ah, uh, oh, oh, so that wasn't a giant stomping, that was a heartbeat. Okay. I thought that was a giant stomping or something. Alright, nope, nope, nope. <laughs> All right, now <laughs> there's such a thing as trying too fast. All right, one minute and a few seconds left. All right, slide there. All right, as soon as this pops up, we're moving. Grab on through. All right, what's down here? The same old, same old. Hat, sure thing, Angela. One sec. All right. Now this one, I want to wait till it gets all the way down or near enough to it. There you go. go. Alright, 11 seconds. Oh, God. Actually, you know what? It's a risky maneuver, but I bet you could skip one or two of those ladders. I wish there was a checkpoint closer to it, but yeah. If you if you threaded the needle just right on that, I bet you could make it. But it'd be it's a risk. I'm gonna try it. Whatever. Fuck it. We ball. Can't do much about this one though, because that corner right there would it block me if I tried to skip it. All right, here we go down. All right. Oh, whew, that was close. All right, like I said. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Don't get... Yeah. I, I tried to be too cocky on that one. Um, well, it's a mixture of like halfway doing it and halfway not doing it. That's the problem. Ball too hard, yeah. Yeah, I, I didn't really get to quite... The, I, I was almost at the ball in section, but... Uh, we got a little bit of a, a course correction to do here. Slide there. All right, what's on the other side of this? All right, down the hallway here. All right. Now we gotta mind ourselves here and not <laughs> get too dead on the spikes. Uh, 
I feel like it's very close. Like, if... if uh, uh, I don't know how necessary the ladders are. Because I, I feel like that time when I ran out of the timer there, uh, I was not... I was not too far behind where I should have been. Uh, as far as that. If I if, if one were to take the ladders. So, maybe that is the secret to this. I'm not even sure I can leave here until I do it, so... I might be stuck here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, sorry, random, but is the song uh, "Ball So Hard"? Motherfucker, want to find me? Or motherfucker, want to find me? Uh, um, fine. I think F I N E. I think that's it. But I'm not 100% on sure that. I'm pretty sure. Alright, fuck it. Okay, wait. Now, you see that? See how I'm like hanging off the ledge there? I, that was kind of a BS spike right there, I feel like. I'm gonna have to call a foul on that one. And the reason why I say uh, it's fine is because I think right after that they say, but first they gotta find me. I, if, I, if memory serves. Spike fell. God damn, god damn. Oh. No. Oh, it's not. It's so much for this run, eh? Whatever. This, we're just doing some recon at this point. Makes sense they want to get everything out of the can out of there. Yeah. It's, 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 it's close to the rap uh, thing of rhyming a word with itself. <laughs> Which sometimes you gotta do, but it's not really great. <laughs> Alright. Like I said, we're... we're... Okie dokie. So maybe that was not it. Uh, let's go to the left of that. So, we'll make the first jump, and then we'll try to edge it as close as possible. That's probably going to be it. Also, fell for that one. I think, and that other, that one on the other side, that's a trap. You don't need that. You don't need that. That's just there to throw you off the garden. Alright, so you hit this. Up we go. Alright, that, that was pretty slick right there. Clean as a whistle. Just waiting here. This takes forever to get through. I'm gaming. Hell yeah. <laughs> could it be? Could the gamer powers be activating? Who knows? Find out on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. Also, if I uh, make it to this spike pit alive. Alright, through there. Alright, whoa. Alright, that, that wasn't gaming so much. See, I've... What do y'all think? Do you think I should be trying to grab that ladder and go down, or should I just try to hang right, or should I grab the ladder and just use that to aim for a shot? I don't know. Can you hold up to catch them? Um, yes, I think. I don't know. I'm trying. That's what I, I feel like. That's what I'm doing, but I might not be. But the ladder. I've always had bad luck with the ladders in this game. Okay, that was not clean right there. Oh my god, we're lost. <laughs> okay, so this one we're just gonna go through and try to land, I suppose. Because we're not gonna win it this way. Lost about three or four seconds on that one at least. Alright. And this section here just takes way too long, I feel like. Alright, and then the heart starts beating. Actually, I should be looking at that side. Alright, so like I said, first... You know what? Fuck it. I don't know why I said that. So don't hang right off the edge. Alright, so try to go a little left, but not too far left. 
and they go straight down. Maybe that'll work. Maybe it won't. Alright, right there, like I said. It's a, it's a uh, deceptive trap right there. Hit that. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Alright, that ledge jump was... Eh. Hit that. See, this middle section here, I wish they'd take it out, because that's just how many times you got to do it on the replay, you know? And down we go, right here. Ah, uh, this section sucks so much. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Okay, so I didn't go far enough. Man, maybe you really do have to take the ladder. I'll try the ladders again. Because this one is not working out. Uh, too many mundane platform commutes, yeah. For sure. It take, takes a lot of the, uh, the, the tension out, I think. Need more spike action. Well, maybe a little less spikes. <laughs> maybe, uh, you know, a lever here or there would be kind of nice. I mean, that one is cool. I see that one. You could probably play that better. But yeah, like this, it just slows it down and it burns time. Which I get that they're trying to do, but... Okay, that's the first time I fell for that, I think. <clears throat> I'm going to keep grinding it. We'll get it. <laughs> Alright, like I said, hit that one, that one, that one. You can do two. Okay, that sucked. Right there. Whoopsie daisy. Right here. Bam, bam, bam. Alright, very good on that. If I can get this and just barely sneak it through. All right, like I said, we're going to try the ladders again. We're going to see how that works, but... Like I said, I just haven't had great luck with ladders. Here, and there, slide, and we're gonna start hearing the heartbeats pretty soon. All right, through. Uh, okay, so the th the problem with that one is I didn't make it far enough over. I think I overcorrected because I I, was, I figured I was gonna, or maybe I jumped too late. Because I'm trying. If you land against the corner of the wall like that, it's gonna take a lot of your momentum out, and you'll never make it over there. But at the same time, uh, if you do it too low. You're not going to make it over either, so. Alright. Very good, very good. This is, I feel like this is where save states would be kind of cool. I mean, cheesy as hell, but for practice anyway. A practice mode with save states, and then you have to actually do it one-on-one -on -one would be kind of a nice compromise. All right, that almost nearly killed me right there. Safe scummer, yeah, a little bit, <laughs> a little bit. All right, that was pretty good there, I guess. Actually, you know why am I climbing down ladders when I could be jumping down ladders? All right, come on, come on, come, on, get me. Get... Oh my God, two seconds left. Oh. I probably should have explored that room a little bit more. Okay, so it looks like there's possibly three or four pieces of this. Mirad, el portal de la rosa azul se ha cerrado. El fragmento ha regresado y el cristal se está formando de nuevo. Ah, yes, the the crystals are charging again. The world has returned to its order. <laughs> Por favor, ayudadme a conseguir el resto. Help me charge the rest of these crystals. <laughs> For you, Miriam, I will do this. Mirad, 
El cristal del viaje se está restaurando. Siento cómo su magia se recupera. Yeah. <risa> Por favor, ayudadme a recuperar el resto de fragmentos. All right, so that was a nice little side diversion right there. But now it's back to business. All right. Mm, did I? I never did go over here, did I? Ouch. Wifey specifically asking you to charge crystals. This is what gaming is all about, truly. What do we got here? Oh, damn. It's a deep little pit here. Uh, let's check right first. Oh, and a teleporter. Very cool. But what's over here? Morning and... Oh, this is like the pirate area. Alright, we'll check this out a little bit more. I haven't seen this side of it before. A lot of these weird dudes, and the thing is, if you kill them, they stay there and they come back. Alright, what do we got? Pray to you. So we skipped this whole cell over here. Let's check it out. Okay, so we cleared that. I don't expect we'll be here too long, but maybe there'll be something cool to find. Yeah, we're, whoa, whoa, we're deep, because the rest of this area is like up here maybe it's hard to say oh shit don't get anchored on he's anchory all right watch this all right that was a bad parry Okay, that does a lot of da that does a shitload of damage. I'm not gonna lie about that. The roll, not so much. The anchor, who knew getting clubbed in the head with an anchor from uh, ten feet up in the air is gonna kill you? It's really uh oh oh I remember these uh electric enemies here. They're kind of a pain in the butt. Let's see what's over here. Um. Uh, Wow, I'm just doing a lot of nothing here. Oh, and this is... Yep. This is the area that I couldn't get back from, I think. So I might have screwed myself right now. But you know what? Dying fixes that, right? Because <laughs> I can just... Uh, <laughs> I can come back here. Alright. I do want to get my guilt fragment back. But at the same time... I'm not so attached to it that I want to lose my height advantage here. I, and I just don't really use the fervor that much. I'll be honest. I probably should. Okay, damn, that hurts. Actually, why am I fighting this guy? I, I should just be running. Okay. Man, those anchors, they just... They're something else. Maybe I should even practice parrying them. I'm not sure. Alright, so I can't do anything all on that side. Um, mm, these statues kind of give me pause. What are they? What do they mean? What are they for? Alright. Pretty easy to dodge, I suppose. Now this electric stuff, not so much. Alright, guilt fragment, thank you. That's just one of them, however. Can get on the ladder. Alright, I need a different power-up to do this part right here. So I might be here for no reason at all right now. Man, there's more of this game left than I thought. I thought I was going to possibly finish it today. I don't think it will. 
And I fell off again. Well, what can you do about it? Actually, I haven't been here before, so this is actually not that bad. Really would like to know what's causing all this. Um, hmm. Oh, it's these ladies. I remember now. They do a ton of damage, by the way. Die. Uh, well, at least we got each other. <laughs> So once again, skipping skipping the weird dudes with anchors. Just trying to get there back as fast as possible. Taking as little shock damage as possible, however, recognizing that it's not avoidable really. <laughs> guys hurt. Alright, what do you got here? Back up on the hill. Uh, well, he'll catch that ledge eventually. <laughs> Alright. I was going to say this is a... I wonder if there's a... Uh, I wonder if that would be considered of a magical nature. Or if it's a separate thing. If I should put my magic resist on. I'll try that anyway. So what do we got? So let's turn off our fire resist and put on our magic resist. This is magic, yeah. Let's try that see if that helps. Yeah, there might be a separate electric category. I know there's a poison category and a fire category at least. but Alright, now that we passed him. Right, jump off of here. Okay. Okay, alright. No worries. Alright, jump. Alright. Damn, this ledge <laughs> is the worst. There we go. It's, for some reason, it's trickier than a lot of the rest of them. Alright, grab uh, our guilt fragment here. Alright, cool. And there's another one right here. Alright, what if I just dealt with her remotely? You can dodge Dinker, you can dodge an electric shock, that is true. Okay. I do hate how you Sometimes, uh, when you heal it, you, you don't have to send there and go through the whole animation. Sometimes you do. And the difference between them, I'm not sure when that... Ah, oh, fucking hell. I should have... I, I was trying not to waste my vials, but I forget how powerful those attacks are. We'll give her one more shot here. Come on. There you go. Try to do better avoiding these electrical situations. Alright, that ledge. The enemy. Alright, now I should have another guilt fragment waiting for me right here when I get in, which will give me a little bit more health. Okay, whoa, do not get hit again. Alright, that didn't do much damage. Alright, heal, heal, heal. Heal again. These are really annoying enemies, by the way. Whoever put them in the game, great job. 
Whew. Uh, can I... Do I have enough fervor for that? No, I don't. Shit. Yeah, I think that's probably good for today. <laughs> we did, we got our third wound. It's about three hours here, so uh, maybe I'll do some more Thursday or something like that. But yeah, I'll take us to Zatsu here. Alrighty, uh, lots of dog. All right, thanks for coming, everybody. Uh, we got a couple bosses today. Not too bad, not too bad. Annoyance supervisor is a real career. <laughs> I bet. Uh. Yeah, thanks for coming, Wiz. Appreciate it. So, let's see. who Who's on the old Twitch tonight? Let's see. Uh, I haven't raided Vanessa in a little bit, so let's raid uh, Vanessa Leona. Playing Monster Hunter. I appreciate it. Thanks for coming, Lid. Alright. Vanessa Leona. Alright, cool. Uh, like I said, maybe Thursday I continue this. We'll see. And I'll see y'all later.